Hello everybody and welcome back to Willow Wire. Today we are playing Dungeon Defenders. I actually just beat the game and recorded it, and I'm just continuing onward. <laughs> Bonus, Glitter Helm Caverns. We only got three more to go, and I've only got a little over a month to do it. Plus the other games, so. I'm in a little bit of a rush. I have never played this one before. This one is brand new for me. I think. Pretty sure the most I've ever done is actually just beaten the main game. But I do have the add-on content. The DLC and all that. So let's see. We got... What is the point of this path? Oh, there's a way that you can go up this way if you needed to. Okay. And is there a crystal there? No. Is there a crystal this way? No. Whoa, there's a big crystal thingy down there. Huh. Alright. Uh, so... I could put a thing right here if I really wanted to, but... I got a decent amount to work with, so let's just start with a bumper here. Keep them a good distance from the crystal on this side. How many crystals we got? Oh my god, this place is huge! There's four crystals? Seriously? Oh boy. Oh, I see why it gives me a little extra for defenses. Oh, this is gonna be hell. And this path is just brutal. Granted, if I do it right, I could make it so that they fall into those holes. Wait, there's a crystal right before it? Why? Why would they do that? This place is horrifying. nuts. This is not going to end well. I have such a distance to run that I'm going to be pretty much entirely relying on my uh, weapons, like on my turrets and stuff. And there's going to be birds! What psychopath made this? <laughs> Who thought this was a good idea? I want to know who approved of this level. They, uh, I need to have a word with them. I feel like there's some OSHA violations that need to be talked about. Okay, there's another crystal down here? Thought I already got to them all. Apparently I did not, and this one has two paths to it. Lovely. Alright, well. For this one, we're going to go ahead and put a bouncer right here. So they just fly right off. But I ain't dealing with them. This side is nothing. How many birds? Just two, it looks like. I don't know where they come from just yet, because okay, so that one's going to be the opposite, so they're going to come up this way. So I will need to put a turret right 
here. Unfortunately, those stairs are wider. All right. And then this way can also go this way, but that's taken care of. So I'm also going to need a turret for the birds, but I don't know where the birds come from yet. How am I supposed to protect against the birds if I don't know where the birds come from? There's more over this way. What the actual heckity heck? All right, well, they're gonna be forced to single file in this spot, so if I just simply put a blockade here, I could put a turret right here. And they'll have to single file right into that thing. This way, however, is going to be a little more complicated. Hopefully that works. I guess since I don't know where the birds are coming from, I'll just put an archer thingy right here to guard the whole thing. And then, let's see, that's protected, sort of. That one's protected. And that one's protected. My word. All right. Well, we're just gonna go with what we got now. Just take a quick look and make sure, yeah, there's no more chests. So we'll go with what we got now. Let's learn where those birds come from. Birds come from the down. Which way is the down? The down's this way. They come this way. Bird, 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 bird. coming from this way? Wait, now this one's backwards! Frickin' A. Luckily, there was only two birds. There's ten waves? Holy crap. And these ones automatically have bombs. That's great. fell down there. This guy held his own pretty good. But we are going to put a turret here too. Still got to figure out where the next birds are going to come from. 
Now that I know there's freaking four and an ogre at the same time. There's only four birds though. There's only four. So they literally can come from anywhere, it seems. <sighs> Could at least give me an idea of where they're coming from. That's weird. In the last episode, I thought I only needed 8,000 before I would level up. Maybe I leveled up during it and I just didn't realize it and I used it or whatever. In the heat of the moment, forgot it all. I don't know. It doesn't look like there's anywhere that can attack from unless they come through this window. Can I find anything in this window? No. He goes with a shot. I don't think this one can get attacked by birds. I would not, you know, count it out, but I th think it should be safe. And this one here, I've got an archer on it. There's two down here, right? No, there's just one. So the only two that can get attacked by the birds would be these two. What size the ogre come from? It doesn't say. How could it not tell me where the ogre comes from? Whatever. Last time it all came from down here, so. Okay, so the biggest thing of enemies is going to be coming from the middle. Basically the middle. Alright. Still, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put a turret right here. Just in case there's anybody remaining that gets through. I'm gonna upgrade this one. Slice and dice. Don't have room for now. I really wish I knew where they were going to be coming from. I guess I probably should go this way. Because this one up here, it's only got the one defense, but that guy's got some bombs coming at it. Man, this is tricky. Just in case all this fails, I don't think it will, just in case, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Is there anything down there actually? Uh, nope. There's another chest coming up over here. It's giving me a lot of money to work with, it's giving me a lot of defenses to work with, so I mean, I can't be too upset, but I don't know where these guys fly in from, which makes me fairly upset. You know what, that's actually a very good point. So what I'm gonna do is put a blade here. Just so there's something to attack the ogre if he does come from down below. And then right here we're gonna put another slice and dice. Okay. 
I'm doing good so far. One more chest left. Where's that last chest? Oh, it's down here. And then because some of these guys can definitely come down here, we'll build another turret right here. chest down here. Where is it? It's up there somewhere. There you are. Get a bad feeling about this. Uh, yep, that looks like it. All right. went down wicked fast. So my crystal still ended up getting hit. That's actually kind of annoying. I think it was this one. Seems like the birds are just going to continuously come from down there. Pretty quick and easy now that I uh, don't have any more turrets or anything to place. Still got three more waves to go. I bet you there's a boss for this too. Don't worry about this yet. These are all taken care of.
really wish I knew which crystal got hit. I'm almost certain it was the one down bottom. How in the world? There was some over here. Some of the birds must have come this way. Well, that is a very bad sign. Not really sure what to do about that. They must have come through that window like I was thinking. Are there any more chests? How did I not see that? Alright, let's see. Those little side ones can be hard to see. So, let's try and upgrade for the ones down here. This one's probably the most important one currently. I'll save that so I can upgrade it after. Things still got through. I'm not seeing an ogre. Oh, there he is. How are they hitting this? Maybe the ogre's range reaches. No, that wouldn't make sense. It was this one that got hit, though. Hmm. Well. That's not irritating at all. So it stop slamming that door. It's one problem with having the game room literally right beside the kids' room now. Any slamming they do, I can hear. Alright, two more waves to go. Did they destroy one of my defenses? Yep, they did. At least it was just the barricade. Could always do a bumper, I suppose. I mean, I do got four after all. Okay, how many ogres? Two ogres, 12 flyers. I don't know how much I could do about that area, though. Actually, wait, how much does it cost for one of the turrets? Six. That's unfortunate. Nope. 
coming back here. I think I'm going to upgrade this little wall. And then I'm going to sell this one. I'm going to upgrade this one. And I'm going to come back down here and I'm going to get that crystal protected on the other side. I think the birds are flying this way and that's why my turret's not getting them in time. Let's try that. Maybe that'll help get it in time. Now we'll come back over this way. We'll put a bumper up here in front of this one. And then we can go over here and get the money. problems is I don't really know where the ogres are going to spawn and I don't know where the birds are going to spawn. All I know is that there is 12 and 2. The ogres at the very least are dying really fast. Like they're getting obliterated. Doesn't look like anything's come down this way. If I can get 700 I can get that upgraded and then nothing's going to stand in my way. But that needs to be upgraded too. So that didn't happen, but that's okay. I'll upgrade this one instead. And there is one chest left over here. One over there. And I think that is it. Two hundred eighty seven to work with. Yep, there's a bird coming down this way. I think this one has the least chance to actually go in. Got him. I'm just tearing right through the ogre now. No, 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 no. That was almost bad. It almost threw me off. There's only a couple more to go. I was 
Frickin' wyverns are a pain. It does seem like the ogres are cycling through the things, so I think the ogres are going to come through the far side this time, where my bouncer was destroyed. At least I think that's where my bouncer was destroyed. Oh, no, I know where my bouncer was destroyed. Never mind. That's for this, though. Those birds are relentless. Man from this one though, holy cow. short. Didn't notice. <clears throat> Did almost lose this one. That's not good. I don't want to be losing that one. There is not a lot of help back here. So there's another two defenses over this way. So if I go this way, yes, it should be. I thought I already got these ones. I could have sworn I got these ones before I even came back up. That's weird. Still don't have 700 though. see any more chests there. No more chests around there. The only damaged one over here is that one. I'm not going to worry about that. <clears throat> 16 flyers. going that way. I don't know if they're going to get to it or not. I missed. Got him. Still more birds.
was brutal. Freaking brutal. That was loud, and that was brutal, and I did not appreciate it. This is the boss wave, though. You, sir, do not function the way you were meant to. Oh, look at that, there's stuff out here, too. <clears throat> Nothing came down this- I didn't even get to leave this area, everything happened so fast. All the ogres came this way. Which I guess is a good thing since I was down here, but damn. on everything. Nothing's gotten over here yet. Freaking five ogres and 30 flyers. Are you serious? 30 flyers? Six hundred and eighty enemies. Oh my. I see this went very poorly. Freaking bombs. Okay, we actually got something that might be better. Good, except for electric. No, it doesn't have health, speed. So my range goes up, but I lose eight attack on my thing there, but get six health. Oof, my attack rate goes down too. So the health is definitely better than the cast rate for myself. The speed is nice, the rage is nice. Tower health is nice. I lose four range though, and I lose one of that in eight attack. Losing eight attack, that's big. Well, I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's get that. That. Can't upgrade those. I can at the very least repair them. I think there's going to be two, oh, three more chests, if I'm correct. probably won't survive this attack, unfortunately. I think I missed a chest. Yep, right here. That's a big sword, and it's weak. There we go. All right. That one up there is still injured. 
all of those are injured. I think that's a health thing for my item, though. I think it's kind of hard to tell which one is massively injured and which one isn't. I don't see a single chest left, however. I've been known to miss them, though. So, who knows? Nah, screw it. I'll just heal us. Better than having to go and repair a whole new one. Alright, 680 of these guys. Got two flyers coming from down there, two flyers coming from this way. Did it. There we got more. Took out those ones. Sweet. They bust through all this. I got an achievement! Oh my god, that's my first one in years! <laughs> okay, uh... Oops. Definitely want health now. Could probably use one on myself. Gonna bring my attack up again. Holy cow, I actually did it. I wouldn't have been building all those defenses at the front there if I would have known that uh, I had already beaten it. I honestly thought it said there was a boss wave. Well, whatever. Now that I know where the actual flyers come from, I might be able to get a better scenario to uh, 
not get my Eternity of Crystals hit as bad. This one right here, I don't understand how the hell they managed to get through all of that, to be perfectly honest. I feel like I just got a life achievement. I finally got an achievement on this game. Life goal met. If I remember correctly, this is one of those ones that it's not possible to get uh, every achievement simply because there's no online anymore. I could be wrong. I actually have to look at the achievements to find out. But we've been doing this for almost an hour as it is, so I'll look at the achievements real quick. I'm not going to do another level. Normally I try to get two levels done in one, but these more difficult levels have been taking longer, especially with 10 waves. It's a lot of freaking waves. Maybe at some point I'll show a survival one after I've beaten all the little levels here. Alright, is there anything left on the map? I don't see anything. Okay, so we shall leave. Let's go to the crystal. What next level is it sending me to? Sent me back here. Alright, so next time we're going to do the DLC, the Mistmire Forest. So let's go ahead and check the shop. We'll check my item box first. I don't believe I picked up anything worthwhile. Why is that? I don't do that. Oh, I probably had it for the other characters. Whatever, I don't care. There are itty-bitty things, I'm not going to worry about it. Actually, I'll keep that one. I almost got 13 pages. Mind you, we were deleting some of these things as we were going. 846. Keep doing that, we'll get it in no time. And that's no longer worth it, apparently. I don't fully see that it's not... Oh, because of the flame. Yeah, you're right. That is not actually worth it anymore. And then these legendary gauntlets are technically better, but I've already bought something, so... Don't need any of that. Alright, well... Oh, right, the achievement. I almost forgot. There's only a 10 pointer. Complete all levels on any difficulty setting. Okay, so that one was counted and the DLC is not. So the 15 million, I'm working on that one very slowly. All pet types, not gonna happen. Reach level 70 will probably happen. On hard, will probably happen. Insane, mm, not so sure about that. All challenges on insane, screw that. Now, the survival wave 15 on medium, I might be able to do that. Now, what I'm concerned about is the, um, pure strategy and the flawless victory ones. I mean, on medium, maybe. Mm. That one's going to be a hard one because I only got my boys to play this with. And admittedly, my four controllers suck because I don't have backs for all my controllers. So all I, I've got three backs and then two controllers that are corded that don't work and one controller that's really small and works when it wants to work in the button stick. Uh, and this is just getting everything. So, yeah, it's not... I guess you can get them all, but it ain't going to be easy. It is definitely not going to be easy. I just realized something as well. I could have sworn I had a baby dragon. And I think it's gone. No, it's still there. He's still right there. Little tiny baby dragon. I only got him... Oh! Oh! I have Squire Guardian! <laughs> when did he get there? What's the star? He's not considered better though, unfortunately. But what's the star? Guardian's range? Well, that's cool. He can get to level 32. 
I won't lie, I'm a little bit confused. I don't know how I got him. Nor do I understand why he's quite as weak as he is. And is this Squire's range? Is that my range? Or, like, why is he so much weaker than the other ones if he's special? Huh. Still cool that I got him. I, I guess I just had to beat the game of the Squire, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you have, hit that like, subscribe button. I'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye!